Um, I think Warlord is whatever because you have to, you usually want to play six. I think Overload you can't really carry Deja. I think Warlord is good if you're like for early mid game. It's really or not Warlord, Electric Overload. That's just broken for early mid, but it straight up falls off like crazy. <clears throat> I got five out. Um. Uh, what else is there? Oh, Dawnbringer is good, but like, but yeah, like they're all okay. But Pirates Greed, Electric Overload, I wouldn't recommend. But also, there's different BIS depending on. So like, Dawnbringer Archangels is, is more valuable. Spell Sword IE JG is more valuable. Attack Speed just straight up AP is more valuable. <clears throat> you basically build the trait that you don't have. If that makes sense. You want to build the trait. So like, for example, if uh, if it's Alacrity or whatever it is. The one that gives you attack speed, dexterity. I don't even know what it's called, but basically the one that gives you attack speed. <clears throat> why would you need more attack speed? Just fucking, you're attacking really fast and make your attacks matter. So just build some fucking AP. If you have a lot of AP, then you want your like cast to do a lot of damage from spell sword. So you just go like IEJG. Like Dawnbringer is like a more like stall comp. So Archangel is better, like Ginsu's is okay. Um, yeah. So this one is Executioner's Edge. And honestly, this one is not very good. But it's not that bad. But also, the, the number one trick to play Deja, I don't even know how Deja stats are so bad. Deja basically, don't greet BIS. Just fucking slam some bullshit and call it. Like, Deja's good because he can use, like, a lot of items. Yeah. Did anyone ask? Yeah, good one, bro. Uh, 